Um, what is Positive Image? Positive Image is a campaign that's going to help inspire confidence in everyone. So it's not just about young people, it's about us all. 73% of women, for instance, feel very concerned about the way they look and a lot of them, it affects everything they do. Um, it will affect their relationships, it will affect them going out and enjoying themselves, it will affect what they do for a career, what hobbies they do, and it really is affecting people's lives. Not just women, men, and not just young people, but all people. And therefore, there are a lot of campaigns out there that are anti-bullying or, you know, beat anorexia, all of these are challenges. What I wanted to do was understand how we could inspire some confidence, because when I went through my challenges as a younger person, I know when I finally achieved things, when I finally did things, I felt better for it. And that's what we're trying to do. So it's complimentary, it's a campaign, it's not a charity or anything, and it's just for people to turn around and say, I'm hoping I'm going to feel a bit more confident about things, I'm hoping that I'm going to feel like I can do something today, and that will make them feel better. Right. Why did you get involved? I decided to start this because A, I'm a mum now, so I started thinking about my own daughter and, and what she might have to go through in schools. Because the statistics are so scary. If you look at statistics on self-harm or suicide due to bullying, the amount of cyberbullying and trolling that goes on these days, some of the challenges out there. The bullying that I went through, for instance, as a student, was a group of 30 people maximum. The bullying that children and students face now, and even adults, it's hundreds of thousands of people potentially and that really worried me and I wanted to do something that would actually open the door on this and kind of say do you know there is the world would be a really boring place if we were all the same and what we want to do is say we're all different we all bring things different things to the mix and therefore that should be celebrated and it shouldn't really be criticized or critiqued you should be allowed to be who you are and what you are in the space as long as you're not causing any harm or upset to anyone else right um how can people get involved? Well, a campaign is meant to be really accessible, so people can get involved however they wish to. We've got some downloadable information if people feel like they need some support. We've got a directory of places that people can go if they feel like they need a specific challenge or a specific area sorting out. Or hopefully they'll get involved by wanting to do something positive and wanting to create something. So particularly in Calderdale College, which is our first educational partner, and we're so delighted, and I'm particularly delighted because it's my local college and I have yeah. great relationships here. It's about saying, look, let's see what we can achieve in November. So I know that we're going to be doing a rap song um, called Stand Tall, which is all about feeling more confident. We're going to be building a walled area for people to sign up. We're going to be doing some make unders. We're going to have lots of activities. But they can go online. They can talk about it. They can just buy a wristband and, and make sure that people know that in that month of November, they're going to be doing something positive that month. They can hopefully be helped by someone who feels a bit better about themselves. So we've got a donate now hour scheme where... People who have gone on and achieved can go and have a chat with someone and, and, and inspire a bit of confidence in them. There's lots of ways. So we've tried to make the site really accessible, really friendly and really easy to use. And the best thing about it is you don't have to put any details in to get information. So you, don't, you can be anonymous all the way through this if you want. No one has to know if you're feeling a bit nervous about things. Right. What is happening at Coldwell College for our positive image? Well, we've chosen Calderdale College because they're very forward thinking as a partner and the great thing I've already experienced with the team so far is that they're so accessible and willing to provide a better future for students and they really understand that it's not just about the academic, it's about how we all feel. So they've been brilliant to work with and I'm really looking forward to seeing things like the wall come to life, which will be everyone's thumbprint, signing up to say, yeah, yeah I'm part of this. I'm really looking forward to hearing what the song's going to sound like. Um, and I'm looking forward to also knowing what the students want. Some of the students are going to be coming down to the big launch meeting in London um, where we start to work out how we build a future for positive image and they're going to have their voice heard in the same room as you know, hopefully Wayne Hemingway, as, as musicians, as, as fashion icons. People are all going to be in that room. Sports stars like Diane Madal, who you know, is an amazing Olympic athlete. We've got amazing people involved and Calderdale College students are going to be right in there as well giving their voice on what needs to be done. Oh. When is the launch? The official launch is the 1st of November, but because Calderdale College are really special, <laughs> yours actually happens on the 31st of October. And that's just so we can let everyone give it a sneak preview of what's going to be happening and hopefully we're going to get some photography and some film crews here and things that day so we can start to show what it might look like in other colleges and schools. And the most exciting thing for me is 
Coldsdale College are going to be writing the blueprint for what other colleges and schools do in the future. So rather than something being a legacy that's set in a school, for instance, in the South, we're going to have this northern facility that's creating what other schools and colleges can do to inspire their students. And I think that's just a lovely thing from someone who lives in Halifax. I think that's really inspirational thought to think that Coldsdale College are going to be kind of movers and shakers nationwide. Yeah, that's brilliant. Thank you. No problem, thank you.